here when that happens. Say hello to my new creation. Noodle Arms Man. And who's a great fire of those arms. I'm Mary getting close to finishing the background. Or the floor background. He's from what I call Quest West. Quite then in Iceland. As you can tell, he got long on noodle arms. His head looks like a ball and pen. And he wears a blue outfit. Like a candy cane. Like peppermint. And flavor. To be as like clown nose. Black peoples. I mean, oh, circles. His eyes are really white colored. This is my new design. Got cartoon white gloves. There's a pocket watch he got in his pocket. Other one has also pockets. Sky, well, white brood. Oh, tie. Sky blue. Blue pants. Brown shoes. I can't keep this thing still. See brown shoes. The color underneath is form of a shoe feet. Sorry, the music was catchy. There's that line on top of his bowler hat. Called. I think I just put it away. Oh, it's right here. Obviously, using the same color as the foreground. Ginta. I would say he's almost similar to Peppermint Butler, except he. This is his. Long stretchy arms to give people hugs by wrapping around them. This is kind of my new design I came up with. So I've already done two new characters in one day already. Well, despite the spire I just showed you the other day, I come up with some new character designs almost every day. Could come up with some new ones too, might. Especially if they look like this color design, like peppermint. And color. Red light stripes. Or ones that look like candy. The flavor. I'm thinking this is a perfect music for this moment. The perfect new story. The tale. Of West West Quentin. And I slam. Actually, sounds like a good ring to that. You might think he's a good guy, right? Well, you'll be wrong. That someone was messing up with his gears and stuff. That was that entertained children to turn evil, obviously. And he's forced to fight people, and there's in the fun place. Use his long arms to give them a goodbye hug. Or pick up his oversized these clown shoes. And he has no choice but to attack people randomly. Especially young young kids. Someone was messing up his program from the backside. He turned wicked. So it's unfortunate that most good robots turn, turn insanely evil. Not that he has a choice, that's an obvious thing to do. Try to have call him Mr. Noodle Arms Man, but that would be too obvious. I came up with crazy ideas 
But this one takes the cake out. Perfect. One without naming someone with long, scrawny arms. Like an octopus. Or wrap them around like a serpent. I'm like, yeah, why not make it almost half as easy as it seems? With all five of us cartoon fingers that look like that. And make him as menacing as possible. Make him the most dangerous thing on earth. Plus, I got the idea from. Near Pro. Near Pro. Near Pro. Near Pro from Street Fighter 3. Looks like he's a weird character with stretchy arms and legs. Looks like we his bendable body. I'm like, why not have this guy have long arms instead? Maybe his legs too. So it could be a stretchy, powerful animatronic. Bendable body. I taste of vengeance. And wreck everything he ever sees right in front of him. He'll be like, oh yeah, you better run. And there, boy, I'm gonna give you a good old hug you'll never forget. It's a pretty cool design. Whether you like it or not, this is the closest thing that I had to do that's pretty simple. Thinking like a crazy fighter. Also, I think the drawing gem rules on him fits him pretty well. There's orange, green, green, yellow, green, green, and purple. Oh, wait, that's pink. Fits him pretty well. Makes him a colorful looking character of all time. Once I get this foreground done with, you'll know a true masterpiece of art gallery. The professional work for it, a masterpiece. I know how to come up with amazing ideas. It's pretty fast. Especially this guy here. It looks Perfect. And so the music I chose him for this moment. And then time. Anyways, that's all I can show you guys for now for like nearly almost nine minutes in. Looks impressive, don't you think? We're gonna keep on covering the side the sides and then do the full background. A random color. Oh, and the shoelaces are a white color, too. Farewell.